Good afternoon, everyone. Um, my name is Mrs. Rowe, and I wanted to go over the new topic of math that we're going to be um, starting in the next week or two. And it is repeated addition. It is actually just taking groups of equal value and adding them together. We also call this an array. Um, this is actually like a lead up to multiplication. We will not be multiplying, but this just kind of gets them in the habit of being able to use equal groups quickly. So um, at first you'll find something kind of simple like this. You'll see three groups of three, and you'll just add three plus three plus three, and you get nine. And we can write that as three groups of three equal nine. Very simple. <clears throat> um, as we go down a little bit further, you have bigger and larger groups, um, and sometimes it's a little bit simpler to simplify them and make them into smaller numbers um, by adding some together. So if you take these cards, for example, you have one, two, three, four, five groups of three. You would have them draw one more group to make it equal, so they would do three more, and then you would just count three plus three plus three plus three. And we want to make sure that we're counting correctly. One, two, three, four plus three, and that's five groups of three. Now we know that equals 15. Um, then I'm going to take these and I'm going to kind of combine them together like this, where I have three plus three is six, and three plus three is six, and we know that six plus six is 12, plus three equals 15 just to kind of simplify it a little bit more. Um, they just took these two numbers, added them together to get this sum, took these two numbers, added them together to get this sum, and took this number and just dropped it down to equal 15. As you get further along, you see that the numbers get a little bit bigger. Um, this one is groups of two, and we have two, four, six, eight groups of two, so they would add two eight times. Um, two plus two plus two plus two, plus two, plus two, plus two, let's count, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and they can combine these into smaller groups where it says eight groups of two, so we say eight groups of two, it's the same thing as four groups and basically what you're doing is trying to combine these groups. So you'll combine these two, two, so you have one group, two, three, four, is the same thing as four groups of four. And those both equal 16. Um, this will take a little bit of a practice, but it's not very complicated. Um, it's pretty simple and it's actually kind of fun once you start getting into it. Um, if you ever have any more questions, please contact your homeroom teacher and we will be glad to help. Y'all have a wonderful day.